Ever wonder what Monster High relationships would be creeperific or just wouldn't work? G to the R to the O to the double S. Gross. Let's see if the couple of Frankie and Cleo would make a great pair of booze or would be a bust. Frankie is pretty new to Monster High. I'm Frankie. Frankie Stein. I'm 15 days old and my pronouns are they, them. I'm so excited to be here. Whereas Cleo's been around the pyramid and has established a confident school presence. Of course you would want to be like me. Who wouldn't? First, move with the grace of a pharaoh. Welcome, Cleo! Next picture, please. And this time, I am taking the perfect picture. Remember, Frankie. Chin down, eyes up, cheek turned, hands relaxed, pinky popped, elbow inverted, ankles back, big toes crossed, and then smize. Smize as if your life depends on it. Elbow inverted, uh, ankles back, big toes crossed. Whoa, 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 whoa! Picture taken. Oof. Next picture, please. Oh, oh, I'm so sorry, Cleo. <laughs> Not off to the best start, but maybe Frankie can help Cleo retrieve a priceless necklace. Distract her while Frankie and I get the jewel. Cleopatra's necklace is right there. What's this? I don't know. I've never been in here before. You want to go first? Yep. Anything for you, Cleo. That didn't work either. But did Frankie really mean it when saying anything for you? Anything for you, Cleo. Regardless, these two need to be a little closer for us to see any sparks fly. Party music! <laughs> they actually do look scary cute together. <laughs> yes, just like that. Perfect, Frankie. <laughs> And they seem to really connect after hanging out. They do have similar qualities, after all. You got some right there. <laughs> Both Frankie and Cleo are friendly. Helping's what friends do. I want to go with and be your monster support system. Have detachable <gasps> body parts. Most mummies preserve some of their organs in jars, but I am not most mummies. So I jarred all of mine. Are brutally honest. And I smell really good. <laughs> I don't think you smell that good. A uh, bit sweaty, to be honest. I mean, I'm good at smelling. <laughs> Can we join the squad, too? New students must wait for Fresh Monster tryouts next month. Luckily for those two, I am not pursuing head fear leader this year. And most importantly, have a kind heart. I decided to move out of our dorm. But if you did that, how will you use this witch's lair? Oh, let's get huggy. <laughs> Inside and outside their bodies. Heart poured out. Assignment done. Maybe I should be like Cleo and wear my heart outside my body. It just oh, hurts my insides too much. But can we actually see a romantic spark between these two? Oh, let me your ear. When Frankie's fear leading tryout doesn't go as planned. Give me an X. Give me a K. Give me a Q. What's that spell? Didn't make the team. Sorry. But try again next year. Their kindness gets in the way of their happiness. I won't join either. No, I, I don't want to ruin it for you. You fear lead. I got to get ready for class. Thanks, Frankie. Claudine got picked and I didn't, and now I'm going to miss all the friend fear leading fun. So that's how bottling up your feelings works. I just got to use this to get rid of all the bad feels. Even Cleo can see the change in her friend's energy. Oh, Frankie, you saved me a seat. Okay, your level of pep for a pep rally is seriously lacking. The spill! What happened with tryouts? Didn't make the team. I'm sorry. Sometimes disappointing things happen. Monster High's new Fear Squad! Frankie attempts to bottle up their emotions. <gasps> Gotta bottle up! But too much voltage can cause a blackout. <laughs> Oh, 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 Bolts, what do I do now? Follow my nightlight. 